Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I know I have been away for a minute, but I have been working on a super cool new project and this is it. <laughs> I want to shout out Love It Speaks. I'm going to link her video down below. She did a video where she showed us how to make straight braiding hair into curly hair to do passion twists and spring twists. And this is my result. And the hair came out absolutely beautiful. And I'm now offering this hair as one of my new products for sale on Adorn by Ren. I'm going to link it down below for you guys. And this is just one pack of hair, guys. So one pack of hair contains 60 twisting strands. So yes, this is my result. This is not even 60 twists in my hair. And you see how full it looks? This is about... I would say like 55, 56 because I had a few pieces remaining when I did my hair. And so yeah, this is my new product and I love how this hair came out. It came out so soft and movable. Like I really did not want a stiff end product because I hate when um, the twists and the faux locks and stuff fall really, sh really stiff. So this is the end result i'm not going to do a full tutorial for you guys of how i achieved this look but i am going to show you um the two at the front what i did and be sure to watch this video to the end because i'm going to show you guys how i get these twists to last a bit longer because i want to wear them for like six weeks i don't want to make this video too long so let me jump into the clip of me showing you guys how i install these twists as you can see my hair is already sectioned and I'm just gonna show you guys the two front twists. So the rubber bands are already. So what I do is I go in with my crochet needle and I pull the hair through. And this is where I want to make sure that one piece is longer than the other so that I can achieve the length of twist that I want. And uh, after doing that, of course I'm gonna pull on my hair to tighten and secure the braiding hair. And then, this part is important so that you hide the rubber band. I split the longer piece into two and I wrap it around the rubber band like about two times and then I add the hair back to the twist and begin twisting. So I'm just gonna continue twisting, twisting, twisting. Um, these twists are pretty long. They drop about waist length on me. So this is how I get the style to last longer and this method is especially helpful for those people with longer hair that tends to come out of the twist and stick out of the twist. What you want to do is find, after twisting your hair, find like about two to three strategic locations where the twist feels a bit loose. So just pass your hand along the twist and you'd find places where it feels a bit loose and like it's already kind of um, puffing up and you just want to wrap some twisting hair around it so I just cut off a, a short piece of hair from one of the strands in the pack and I use that to wrap around at specific locations using the same type of motion that you would use as if you are wrapping four locks so you just want to place those strategically along the twist. I have about three on each twist, two to three on each twist. And that is to help keep your natural hair intact, one. And two, it helps prevent your twist from undoing and getting very puffy. So yeah, that was pretty simple, right? So this is how my hair turned out. Let me just show you guys a close up and you will see that the little pieces so like this is a piece that i wrap um right here is a piece that i wrap so you would see the pieces along the twist you're seeing the little indentations along the way but it doesn't disrupt the style too much and i feel like it still looks pretty good so yeah this is how it looks Yeah, I'm really happy with how the hair turned out. I'm really happy with how the style looks and how everything turned out and the whole feel of the hair. I am so pleased with it. 
So again, if you guys are interested in trying out this hair, I'm going to link it down below. So of course, my next video is going to be a week in my hair showing you guys how I maintain this style and everything that I do to ensure that it lasts at least six weeks. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you guys try out my hair. It is really, really good guys. And this is just one pack. Could you believe that? One pack doing your entire head and you get this nice full look okay so let me stop playing in my hair and rambling now thank you so much for watching this video and stay tuned for more great videos i will see you soon bye